Apparently some boy was going to church on a Sunday. Innocent random boy was going to church on a Sunday. And the boys on this estate, they beat him up and they set him on fire. So more nonsense in the social media and that. More lies, more playing victim. More claims that a man is innocent when he's really not. So just start watching a video on YouTube. Apparently an innocent man was murdered. So a man has set off to work in the night. He's gone to link his work colleague. He's jamming in his car. He's chilling in his car. Out of nowhere. A car has smashed into his from behind. Another car has blocked his car in to stop him from escaping. Man then from both cars have jumped out. Surrounded the car, attacked him and murdered him. When I'm watching the video, I'm thinking to myself, this don't sound like an innocent man who's not involved in nothing. Really and truly, this kind of sounds like a setup. No, hold on a minute. A man's gone to link his work colleague in the night, and all of a sudden, two cars have pulled up, manned him with weapons i.e. they came prepared they've jumped out they surrounded him they've attacked him and they've murdered him that's that sounds like a setup to me but whether it was a setup or not whether it was just a chance meeting whether a man was just driving past and they saw him or whatever i know for a fact a man is not totally innocent don't get it twisted i'm not saying a man needs to get murdered but what i'm saying is if you're sitting somewhere and cars are pulling up and men are coming equipped and men are attacking you, more than likely you've done something to someone. I'm not saying that warrants you getting murdered or more warrants someone getting murdered. What I'm saying is a man has done something to someone along the lines. So a man ain't completely innocent. And I need to make a video about this and I will. I make a proper long video about this detailed video about people playing victim and claims of mistaken identity and you see all that mistaken identity most of it is bullshit most of it is the family of the victim trying to make the victim look like some kind of angel on that that's bullshit most of these people that get murdered and that they're involved. I'm not saying that they deserve to get murdered. I'm not saying that. But they're involved in some shit. They've done something to someone. I remember one time I was working in Hackney. And some woman said, oh, the boys on this estate, they're animals. They're ruthless. Apparently some boy was going to church on a Sunday. Innocent random boy was going to church on a Sunday. And the boys on this estate... They beat him up and they set him on fire. When I'm hearing the story, I'm thinking to myself, no, that was no random attack. Whoever that youth was, he was involved in something. The man them on this estate, they had a vendetta against that boy and they caught him slipping. Don't get twisted. I'm not condoning no one, rush no one and set man on fire. But ain't no black youths on ends doing that nonsense. Yeah, black youths on ends might rush someone. But they ain't setting no one on fucking fire. Maybe them white youths up in Cumbria or the north of England do that nonsense. And that. Man them on the ends. Man them ain't going to jail. Man ain't risking themselves going to jail. For setting a random person on fire. Yeah, man them might rush random people. That, that could have happened. But to set someone on fire. But that's attempted murder. Man them out here trying to make money. Man ain't trying to get locked up. Over some random person. The man have caught someone slipping. They got a vendetta against the man. And they rushed him. And they set him on fire. I'm not condoning their behaviour. But I know that you there. He's done something to someone. Somewhere along the line. That girl. Unfortunately the one that got shot in the head. The people them is playing victim. 
Oh, how do you know? This is talking to the police, you know. Oh, how do you know that it's not a racially motivated attack? They wanted it to be a racially motivated attack. You know why? Because they want to play victim. And when they found out that it was a black person that unfortunately shot the girl in the head, they were disappointed. Imagine, imagine, imagine that. A Black Lives Matter activist got shot in the head by a black person. That's nuts. That's nuts. Again, playing victim. This was years ago, though. A man got shot dead in Tottenham. You know, the guy who got shot dead in Tottenham, you know, his missus went on national TV, either ITV or BBC, done an interview and said, my boyfriend was an innocent man. He was not a gang member. He was not gang affiliated. Anybody on ends that knew this guy's name knew he was a road man, knew he was known for doing this and doing that. And she went on national TV and lied to the people and tried to make out that he was a victim. He was not involved in nothing. These people are sick, blood. It's just madness. How is everyone out here claiming that? I know, man. I've heard stories of people that I've seen before and I know of or whatever. I ain't going to go into too much details. But someone that I know kind of got shot in the chest with a shotgun and the person's dad is claiming that his son was involved in some mistaken identity or whatever it? no again when I heard that story I was thinking no because I know I know the person that got shot in the chest he's involved in stuff I don't believe he was sitting in the car and he's you know, he was mistaken for this person or whatever. No. He was involved in stuff. And someone decided to get me. Do him up. But again, the people them are oh, now nah, mistaken identity playing victim and like it's all nonsense, man. 99.9% .9 of these mistaken identities, they're lies. They're lies. But the people them's family always want to try and play victim in that. Anyway, just a quick video. Mm. People they need to stop playing victim in that. There's no way a man is being ambushed. Man coming with weapons. Man coming prepared to go and kill an innocent person. You really want to ride 19 years for an innocent person? Really? Come on, fam. Stay away.